You're grounded. Why? Coach Williams just called me and said you dropped out of basketball. So what? I did not spend all that money on gear and my weekends driving you to practice for you to just quit. I'm sorry, I don't want to do it anymore. I don't care. You're grounded and you're going to practice on Saturday. No, I'm not. What did you just say? I said no. Come here, you. Are you lactating lizard shit? You stay out of this. Shut the fuck up before I have you dead to the ashtray. What? From euphoria. What? You say what one more time, I swear to God I will go full Kanye crazy on your ass. What's going on, Lindsay? I don't want to play basketball anymore. I thought you loved basketball. What happened? He's lazy is what happened. Shut the fuck up, bitch. The only sport you played was the football team. What? What are you not telling me, Lindsay? Diego joined the team. The Diego that beat you up last month? Yeah. Why didn't you tell me? Gee, I wonder why. You're more brain dead than Harry and Marv combined. You don't- God, your voice is more annoying than James Charles. I don't even know how that's possible. Ice cream? Sure. Then we're going to Diego's house. I don't- You can stay in the car. Oh, this should be good. I got it. Hi, yeah, yeah. Who the fuck are you? I do not appreciate that language. I don't appreciate your breath. Now, what do you want? Your nephew, Stephen, I believe is his name, was revving his motorcycle engine at 5 a.m. Sounds like a you problem. Well, I filed a noise complaint. Can I see that? Mm-hmm. I paid a lawyer to write it up. Hmm. <gasps> you can't. Thanks for coming to the sale deal of the day. Three words for a knuckle sandwich. I... What? Um, you know what? I'm absolutely tired of your family's antics. You cannot just threaten people all the time. Actually, in the Bible it says, shallow care and annoy you, tell them to shut the fuck up. The Bible does not... Shut the fuck up. Uh, Motherfucker! Hey! Uh, what? I told you not to touch the fucking thermostat. I didn't. No one else is home, smartass. Steven was just here two minutes ago. Oh, isn't that a convenient story? Your forehead would be a convenient landing strip for a fucking airplane. You little shit. Walter, you better not lay a finger on that child. Susan, this is none of your business. Do I look like I give a shit? Get out of my house. This is the bank's house because your bitch ass can't pay it off. You're not gonna talk to me like- Try me. I will have you looking like you got sad on my Lizzo. He insulted me. You should be more insulted that God gave you that fucking hairline. <laughs> What's going on, sweetie? He's trying to say I touched the thermostat when I didn't. You were the only one here to touch it. When has he ever lied? He lies all the time. He's a teenager. Name one time. Uh... Sounds like you're projecting because you're a liar. I am not. Oh, please, enough shit comes out of your mouth to be a guest on the Joe Rogan podcast. Name one time I've lied. When I saw you buying Magnums. Oh, 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 oh shit. Laugh at this. What the? <laughs> Look at you. Bigger disappointment than a live-action avatar. He got dropped harder than Kanye. Who dropped Kanye? Everyone. Wanna go golf? Bet. God fucking damn it. That's it. Wait, no, I'm sorry. Come here. Are you salty septic sewer saliva swallowing motherfucker? What are you, m and M? I'm about to put my M in your M. What? My motherfucking foot up your motherfucking ass. What's going on, Lindsay? I told him three times to stop cussing. Shut your mouth before I put my fist so far down your throat you look like Lana Rhodes. What the fuck? Bitch, I'm about to have you deader than Yondu, I swear to God. Lindsay. These bitches keep camping and it's pissing me off. See? He won't stop cussing. Well, I can't see, sound, but I can hit you so hard you will. So what if he cusses? Ain't hurting nobody. It hurts my ears. All right, then ground him for hurting your ears. Wait, what? <laughs> yeah, you ground him for hurting your ears and then I'll bury you in the ground for hurting mine. 
Wait, what? Go ahead, ground him. Then I'll ground you. Permanently. I, I don't. What I thought. Now disappear like Amelia Earhart. Ice cream? Lighter. I gotta go fill in this hole in the backyard. What? I'm gonna beat your ass, boy. Wait, 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 what did I do? You spilled Kool-Aid all over my brand new carpet. No, I fucking didn't. Jonah said he saw you. Jonah said John Cena is his uncle. Well, it's your word against his and he has no reason to lie. Yeah, to cover his own ass. I don't believe you. Please, he's more of a liar than Amber Heard. Huh? Hey, you bitch made motherfucker. The fuck you call me? You heard me, you're a bigger bitch than rice gum. I will. Try me, bitch. I will drop you harder than Anderson Silva. I'm good. What I thought. More afraid to throw your hands than Dr. Mike. What's going on, Lindsay? Jonah said I spilled Kool-Aid on his carpet, but I don't even like Kool-Aid. You're a liar. Shut it or I'll pull the Kool-Aid man and treat you like a fucking wall. What? I'll have you looking like Robin from the boys. Jonah? Yeah, Grandpa? <laughs> ow, 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 ow. Did you spill the Kool-Aid? Yes, sir. What you gotta say? Wanna go to the arcade? Hell yeah. Let's go. Stay there! Jesus Christ, stop yelling, Fuzz99. Your little brother just told me you're dating Leandra Hendricks. So what? Get out of my business. You're not the NSA. You're not dating till you're done with college. Girls are just a distraction. And that wig is just a distraction from your big ass forehead. That's it. You're grounded. No, fuck you. Come here, you little... Crystal, you better not touch my baby. Susan? Auntie? Hi, hey, sweetie pie. What are you doing here? I came to invite Steven to play golf. Well, he can't go because he's grounded. For what? She's mad I got a girlfriend. Oh, you goddamned hypocrite. Excuse me? You're a fucking tramp. You're more ran through than a 7-Eleven bathroom. I am not. You have a tattoo on your thigh that says property of Craig Mason. You have a tattoo? You said tattoos were for sinners. That's not the point. That's exactly the fucking point. You're more clueless than Kanye. Hey, I like Kanye. Say some stupid shit like that again, I'll put your face on a t-shirt. Yes, ma'am. Get out of my house. You got it. Steven, let's go. He's not going anywhere. Bitch, I'm about to open a can of Kentucky whoop-ass you don't shut your trap. Steven, let's go. Bye. It's time for bed. What? It's time for bed. I don't have a bedtime, plus school's closed tomorrow. Your mom put me in charge. Go to bed. Well, I'm putting myself in charge, and you can kiss my ass, you little shit. What's going on here? What are you doing here? Fulfilling my sovereign duty to do whatever the fuck I want. His mom said no one would be over tonight. Do I look like I give a fuck? But she said, shut up before I knock so many brain cells out of your skull you turn into a Sneeko fan page. What's going on, Lindsay? He's trying to make me go to bed when I haven't had a bedtime since fifth grade, plus there's no school tomorrow. I'm in charge, you do what I say. Listen, you wannabe Liam Neeson. Uh, he doesn't need to go to bed, it's only 10 o'clock. Yes, he does. Get the fuck out of my face before I knock you out faster than a try guy can cheat on their wife. You can't knock me out, you old... Sorry, you were saying? He hit the ground harder than the baby's career. Huh. Ice cream? Bet. Let's go. Hey! What? Your teacher just called and said you failed your presentation. I'm sorry, I got nervous. Oh, grow up. I have social anxiety. Your generation's so soft. What does that say about the generation who raised us? Well, you little- Are you slimy walrus placenta? What the fuck, ew? That's what the doctor said when you were born. How rude! Shut up, you're more of a disappointment than Dream's face reveal. He looks like a malnourished young gravy. Hmm. <laughs> what's going on, Lindsay? I had a presentation in school, but I got nervous and forgot all my lines. That's just a bunch of excuses. What's the excuse for you being a bigger bitch than Alex Wasabi? How dare you call me? Shut the fuck up before I end you faster than Modern Warrior's career. Who? Exactly. Lindsay, just takes practice to get better at public speaking. Just remember to breathe. Thanks. 
any day. You're grounded. What did I do? Your teacher just called and said you haven't been doing your homework. Homework is stupid. I go to school for seven hours and then I have to do more work when I get home. That's just the way it is. You need to do it. That's like me telling you when you get home from work, you need to do two hours of studying so you can go to work tomorrow. Start doing your homework or you're grounded. No, this is bullshit. That's it. Touch my baby, I'll have you deader than Mr. Miyagi. But he, shut the fuck up before I any faster than Adam Levine can cheat on his wife. What happened? He's not doing this homework. Woman, you speak again, I will knock you out in front of your kid like Austin McBroom. Lindsay, what's going on? I haven't been doing my homework because I'm already exhausted when I get home from school. Exhausted from what? You just sit at a desk all day. Well, I'm exhausted from listening to your whiny ass voice. My voice is not whiny. Please, your voice is more percent whiny than a Kardashian is percent plastic. I don't care, he's still grounded. Does he do good on his tests? Yes, but he needs to do his homework. Get the fuck out of my fight before I end you faster than Ellen ended her own career. Ice cream? Let's go. I got it. Hi, yeah. The fuck do you want? I do not appreciate that language. Oh, sorry, wee wee big et. What? A biblioteca? Library? What do you want, Karen? Your little brat Jonah threw a football at my car. Oh my god, is your car okay? Yeah, it's actually... That's what I'd sound like if I gave a fuck. <gasps> what? So you have no problem with your kid running around causing a ruckus? Woman, I ran out of fucks on my first child and I have three. Oh, so you're just a bitch. Absolutely. fucking -lutely. Thank you for your cooperation. What the fuck? Hey, you bitch! The fuck is your problem? Someone ate all my egos. Chill out, Eleven, I didn't do it. The list of names who could have done it is short and I checked twice. Listen, Santa Claus, I didn't eat your waffles. Yes, you did, and I'm telling Mom. Go ahead, you have no proof. Um, yeah, honey? When did you punch me? The fuck? Language. That was English, thought you knew it. What? I am speaking English. Enough, smartass! You're grounded. Aw, oh, thanks. I like to consider myself humble. Lindsay! Mom! Don't raise your voice at me, young man! Oh, am I yelling? Sorry, my sarcasm is deafening. That's it! You hit my baby, I will have you hit the ground harder than Lizzo falling off the Taco Bell roof. He hit Jonah, and Young Gravy hit your mom. You're my mom. Exactly. What happened, Lindsay? Jonah thinks I ate all his ego, so he told Mom I hit him to get me in trouble. Oh, Jonah, you little hoe. Don't call my bitch. Say another word and I will send you to Aunt May. I ate your egos. Oh. He's still grinding for talking back. Go talk back to Jesus, bitch. Is she breathing? Don't know. Don't care. Fair enough. Who is it? Police opens the door. What do you want, Smirnoff? How dare you call me? What do you want? You hit my wife. Karen deserved it and you know it. I do not disagree with you, but the law is the law. Well, I make my own laws and one of them is I don't give a fuck about what some Arnold Schwarzenegger wannabe has to say. Arnold isn't even Russian, you trailer trash. Get off my property before I have you deader than Russia's economy. How dare you? What are you gonna do about it, Jack? You are going to jail for assault. Try it. I'll have you deader than Putin's political opponents. Assault and threatening a police officer. Put your hands behind your back. Thank me. Fine. Dabra noche. What? Sleep tight, Putin. You're grounded. For what? Because you got in a fight at school. I was protecting my friend. It doesn't matter why. Violence is never the answer. Also, in World War II, we should have just sent a letter and a cupcake to Germany and said, Hey, Adolf, stop being a poopy head. Well, no, don't even try to backtrack. You said violence is never the answer. You're not going to talk to your mother that way. You start acting more like my mother and less like a whiny toddler and I wouldn't have to. Oh, you little... Are you idiosyncratic sticky urinal cake? What the fuck? Ew, don't call me. Shut it. Hey, what do you want? Don't talk to my baby girl like that. 
Fine. What's going on? Jeremy was pushing my friends around so I got in a fight with him. Absolutely not, young man. Fighting is not the answer. Are you kidding me? What? You are a fucking Marine. Well, but that was diff- No, it isn't different. You stood up for what you believe in and Stephen did the same thing. Uh, well, well, she's his mother, so she decides. Well, actually, by the power vested in me, by I don't give a fuck, he's not grounded. Yes, he is. You better stop talking before I have you pissing your pants and running like Tommy Fury. Tommy, I'll shove your head so far up your ass, not even KSI's ego could compete. I'll knock so much enlightenment into your skull, you'll find where Bryce Hall's hairline starts. I'll have your nose so swollen, even Nanny Sun Gib would be horrified. I'll have you deader than Itachi from Naruto. I'll fine. What? He's not grounded. You want me to tell you to beat her? Do you want Michael Jackson to sing it to you himself? Thanks, Grandma. Anytime.